Hi, my name is Gustavo Ariza, and today I'm going to show you how you can create your own GTP and for programming security purposes based on the knowledge you have. The first thing you need to do is go directly to chatgtp.com. From there, go to the section. You are going to see a little section here in the main panel to say uh, GTP. From there, you can start to configure your GTP. Well, you first you have the process also created. The first thing you need to do is put the name, a little description about what is the purpose of the GTP you are creating right now. Also the instructions. Instruction is uh, how the instruction, how you use the GTP. Uh, conversation started is the first uh, comment or the GTP is going to tell you welcome in the chat panel. From there, uh, for example, I am trying to create a train modeling tool based in my experience, and I am going directly to, for example, uh, all the standards like CVE. CVE is a standard for common vulnerabilities in programs. That means uh, PHP, that means web servers, all the final products we create uh, and use in daily in uh, cybersecurity. That also include, for example, antivirus, um, version of the operating system or the firewalls like Palo Alto and others. And what else? Important thing when you create, um, well, CV details is more uh, specific about what is the, it's a database more specific. It's more friendly for the user. That is the reason why I switch from that one to this one. You can see here PHP already 2014 had already 20 vulnerabilities related to the uh, technology. There you have a little description. What is the more common area of the world you are going to find this vulnerability? And also you are going to see things like a CBSS score. The CBSS score is for a catalog and run the vulnerabilities based on the criticality and the problem they have. After that, you also have the CVCWE attached to these vulnerabilities. In this case, uh, the CVE is the number 17. But the difference between CVE and CWE is CWE is more related to vulnerabilities related to the programming languages. That means when you may click in that, you can see uh, the CWE is more related to the programming techniques using for create that PHP version of the programming language. But what had this all standard in common? Those, this, no, those, those standards had in common, uh, basically, they have a database open source free. With that database, you can download these PDS documents. You can download these JSON files or these other documentation. For example, this academic paper is part of the CWE. And you can download all these papers and upload that papers in your knowledge base or GTP product you are creating at the moment. Important things to have is also you have the web search enabled in capabilities. Now I am looking about my first paper to integrate to this uh, GTP and I am going to choose uh, one standard creating for OWASP. OWASP is online web application uh, security project and nothing. I start to look in the internet. I found the chip set and I am going to take all the documentation you can see in the screen and I am going to create a PDF from there. After I create the PDF, I am going to unlock that to a knowledge, knowledge base or database or the GTP.
Meanwhile, if you have any doubt or concern, please contact me directly or put the comment in the description, a common text box you are going to see below. Like I said before, you need to have in capabilities, click or select web search for the GTP, looking in all the internet reference, open public reference about technologies. Uh, DALI, when you check DALI image generation, if this able to you create image about the infrastructure you are dealing right now. And also no for, don't forget to create or ch check the code interpreter and data analysis because with this one, the GTP can process programming languages and give you reference about how to protect these uh, vulnerabilities in code lines. He can also improve your testing in QA or help you to solve problems in the development or application. The question I made to the GTP like you can see here in the right top corner is why you your knowledge database and he telling me okay the documentation you will not provide me the comprehensive overview about trend modeling just give me definition for core questions key benefits process outline all the things related to the document we already will load up and uh, what else when you unlock you can also unlock exercise you already made programming uh, code languages files for example no matter the language is c or php uh, python no matter la the language the important thing is unlock that information of these files compressed in a zip file why we need to do that? Because when he took the compressed file, he is going to put that like uh, or segregate that document you like, like examples of coding programming techniques. Every time you unlock six files or compressed file, he's going to take it. Well, after that, I start to ask into the GTP and to load the document, how he can create a track modeling and he is guy start to getting me the information about it based in the document I created or I will add the organization created and I will add uh, in the GTP and to, 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 like you can see he give me response and mitigation review and validation and for example he give me recommendation for proofing tampering but all is based in the documentation I will add Other thing is uh, you can create actions related to the GTP. You can see in the left button corner a session of actions. Action is for what things I can do with the GTP in specific. It's more customized. Well, after that, I am asking uh, to the GTP Give me the CVE, CWE, and CAPEC, the standard we already review in the process on or in the internet before related to the uh, infrastructure. I am questioning it about it. Um, Uh, like you can see, he gave me CWE 522, uh, CV 2021, 2021-234. And he got in the information because we already select, like I mentioned before, the capability of web search. Mm. With this, I am trying to get in you a free tool when you 
can put together you all the knowledge you got it in your career or your personal experience and from there got it that knowledge and create your own calculator like the mathematical mathematicians guys created at the moment because the AI is only a calculator it's important you filter the data before you log the documents and now I am generate a leader image of because I already select DALI image generation in capabilities uh, important filter the data no unlock a uh, property private documents because that is again to the you know author uh, patent law about ideas is not yours when you finish the gtp you can only keep it for yourself only me or you can put anyone with a link and share the link with another colleagues or publish check or publish that in the gtp store and from down now on another persons can use your gtp and start to work with you and improve your gtp for the future I hope you enjoyed this presentation. My name is Gustavo Risa, and if you have another questions, please let me know. Like I say, put a comment in the chat and I see you.